Hi everybody, Mike Rooney from Move by Real Estate here. Uh, it's one of these things at the moment where the market is crazy hot, right? That means there's more buyers than there are available properties. And that creates an unusual situation in the marketplace, a position of competition. Not just competition amongst buyers, and there is a lot of that right now, but also competition amongst agents. And what it does, it does show us right now in a competitive environment for agents fighting for business. The question I see some people ask is, well, why do we even need an agent right now? Property's going to sell itself. And here's the truth bomb. It's true. It actually can sell itself. And you know what? I would even go so far as to say that I could take a photo of a property from the front street, print it out on an inkjet printer at home, stick it with chewing gum to a window shop front in the local shopping center, and it could probably sell if it was cheap enough. Now, here's the, here's the thing. So what value does an agent actually offer? Now, I think some agents don't actually know this themselves. And this is a really important topic of discussion, right? So what value does an agent, why are we hired? Why are you paying an agent commission? Why do you pay one agent more commission than a different agent? And the simple reality is being a real estate agent is not just about doing an open house and greeting people and welcoming them through and then accepting an offer. If that was all we did, uh, in fact, I, I, I would take it a little bit further and say that's all some agents do do, uh, and that's why some people do have a bad experience. But that's not actually what we're employed for. What an agent is employed to do is to elevate the perception of the value of the property in the buyer's eyes, to actually increase their expectation of value, to actually increase the offer price that they're expecting to offer and pay, to present a property beautifully to elevate it above the competition of other properties in the marketplace. And when, no matter what sort of market we're in right now, whether it be a quiet market where you're fighting to find those buyers and bring them through the property and sell it to them, or in a market right now, right, like right now where there's a lot of buyers, there's not enough property to meet that demand, it's still the same job, right? We still have the professional obligation to present a property professionally, present it beautifully, to suggest it in such a way to a buyer that it increases their expectation of value. It is our job as an agent to actually defend our vendor. People make a mistake sometimes, and even some agents make a mistake, that our job as an agent is to bring people together. We bring a buyer up to the seller's price and we bring a seller down to the buyer's price. I strongly disagree. We are not paid by a buyer. We are paid by the seller. So therefore, it is our job to represent the seller's price expectation. It is not our job to represent the buyer's price expectation. Now, some people won't like me saying that, but that is the reality. Now, we should, as a professional, always conduct ourselves with efficacy, right, to be professional and respectful of buyers, but it is not our job to present a buyer to a seller in such a way that we motivate the seller to accept the buyer's price. It is our job to defend the seller's price expectation, to defend against a buyer who's going to come and try and offer a lower price. And that happens in all markets, whether it be a low market or a high market, like we're in right now. It is our job to actually increase that buyer's price expectation, to actually elevate their expectation of what they expect to pay. It is not our job to be paid more than we actually increase that price expectation. If an agent offers no value to you as a seller, if they don't actually elevate the price of the property more than you're going to pay them as a professional, then I would agree with the people who say an agent is of no value, why have them? If you're engaging an agent who's not defending a seller's price, if you're engaging an agent who is not elevating and increasing that price expectation by presenting the property beautifully, by presenting it in such a way that the buyer can see the potential, they can see themselves living there and fall in love with it, then they're not doing their job. So I mentioned this not to upset people. I do mention this because it is something that I think is a matter for discussion, and I welcome discussion in the comments. You're welcome to have a say. If you disagree with me, please do say so below, and I'm not going to be upset or offended. Right, if you think I'm dead on right, please say so. It helps me make sure that I'm getting the right message out. 
If you have a different opinion or a different perspective, I'm definitely willing to listen and take that on board. I do hope this is of some value. If you'd like me to do a couple more videos like this, please definitely let me know. That also helps me understand what people would like to see more of or less of. I'm Mike Rooney. If this has been of some value, please give the video a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more of this, please definitely comment. If you've got something to say about it, please do. I'm definitely willing to engage and listen and learn. If I'm wrong, if there's other perspectives, I'm definitely willing to learn. I hope you have a great week. It's a challenging time we're in right now. It's a challenging stage of the pandemic. It's a challenging time for buyers. It's a challenging time for renters. It's a challenging time sometimes for sellers. We're all going through tough times. And I want you all to please have a positive outlook, no matter what situation is. If I can help in any way at all, I'm not talking about if you just want to sell and I'm trying to make some money. If I can help in any way at all, please feel free to reach out to me. I always take people's phone calls. If I can't take the call, I always call back. And I always try and help no matter what's going on. All right, I'm Mike Rooney. I'm Moved by Real Estate. I hope you have a wonderful week. And I hope things are great for you in this year ahead.